Well, good evening. Are you tired of waiting? Are you tired of the coronavirus shutdown and lock-in? And um, if you're like me, you're getting a little bit tired of it. I really, really want to get back out there and see my brothers and my sisters in Christ. Remember the Bible passage that says, and this too shall pass? Yeah, I don't either, because it doesn't exist. However, our Bible does tell us in the book of Psalms, chapter 33, starting in verse 18. Behold, the eye of the Lord is on those who fear him, on those who hope for his loving kindness, to deliver their soul from death and to keep them alive in the famine. Our soul waits for the Lord. He is our help and our shield. For our heart rejoices in him because we trust in his holy name. Let your loving kindness, O Lord, be upon us according as we have hoped in you. Interesting, as we talk about waiting, and that seems to be what we've been doing a lot of lately, that the last line, verse of verse 22 says according in the new american standard according as we have hoped in you the alternate reading there is as we have waited on you well i'm sure that this will be over soon and i know that as we read our bibles as we study as we pray and uh, as we do the things around our homes that we need to do uh, god is looking out for us um, and I pray that your trust in him over these last few weeks has grown uh, tremendously. I know mine has. Um, so I hope this short little devotion will help you to um, get past at least uh, a little bit of what's going on. Um, I did want to let you know that uh, by way of announcement that uh, there will be somebody at the church building uh, at tw uh, 10 to 12 on Saturday to ha pass out uh, communion um, supplies. If you need some, please come by and know that you are in our prayers. God bless.